Hello everyone, it's your favorite girl Tenny Maganaki and this is Boombot. <laughs> How have life been generally as an artist? Life been good. Life been calm. You started out as you know one of the biggest viral stars. You know how did skits making start for you? It wasn't skits making. It was just boredom. Okay. Of being in uni and I, I in uni I really didn't like going to parties, so I was always in my room. That was just when I had all the time to create, you know, listen to all kinds of beats, freestyle, and then just go on my phone and just be saying nonsense, I guess. And that's, that was really the basic foundation of everything. Okay, but when you started, was there, was that, was there an acceptability for most of the things you were doing, or it was at a point that people now started noticing that, ah, this Danny baby is funny and she can sing. So, whether downtown, downtown. Well, I wasn't really looking for it to be. For me, it was just an escape. I was just in uni and I was just enjoying myself. So, I wasn't even thinking of it to be something that would explode. Okay, so, what are you currently working on? Album. Actually, the album is done. I've submitted it. Okay. It's just for it to drop. When is it dropping? March. So 19. For, okay. for tenny fans, for the core tenny fans, you're pretty much spontaneous. But what's the process of music like? Because I saw you make a song in one step one. What's the process like? Is it that there are so many beats running in your head? Oh, let me let me understand. It's just music is just what whatever is going on around me. Like, whatever is going on in my friend's life, my life, my family's life. Just something, anything I see, I can I can make into music. Which song brought you the most fame? Case or We Are Mayor? That would be a hard one. I don't know. Well, I think maybe Case, I guess. But We Are Mayor just always stands the test of time. Okay. Um, we're in difficult times now because of the coronavirus and stuff. How is it like? Making music and also you know staying grounded during this time. How has it been for it's you? It's fun being in these corona times. It's not fun because you know you can't hug all your loved ones and but for me I'm not I don't like partying, I don't like I don't really go to clubs. I'm always at home, so it was fun for me to actually have time to create music, to do the things I love. Before Corona I've been flying everywhere. I'm never really around. So just being able to be in one place to actually calm down and enjoy and relax. Okay, I think you guess. don't miss traveling around and the concerts. And I do, I do. But I, I I needed a break. I'd been I'd been it was back to back to back and so when Corona came I could rest. You had a song with Sasha. Yes. Recently. What was it like? Well, not a song. I just featured him in in my my song. Yeah. Uh, he came. He appeared in the video. Legendary. Like I always. I mean, everybody knows. Everybody that knows me knows how much I love him and appreciate his music. And so that was just an honor for me to have him in my video. Mm. And most recently, you and the video. And <laughs> I followed it on Twitter. And how you guys are always meeting at different. Um, joints and points and you say david you must be on my song why was it so important to have you know david on your song because this particular song it had to be him i just heard it my my friends heard it they were like you need to put him on this song it has to be david and see what he did to it killed it so he just had to be david was there any point in your life that you before you started out as an artist was there any point in your life that you said oh Nigerians will accept me. Um, were you having doubts? So I never cared for anybody else. I just cared for myself. And, and not sound selfish. I just really cared about what I was doing. And, and not really how people accept it. 
but mostly how it made me feel how how did i enjoy it when i did it am i enjoying it when i'm doing it that's all that counts for me yeah. why did making an album take so long it had to be right I needed time and Corona was just the right time. Do you understand? So, you know, making this album, I needed time to actually put my thoughts together, coin my melodies together, and make music that came from my soul. Okay, but what I'm seeing now, I see a Tenny who is on social media as a very as an extrovert. But you seem like an introvert. You said you don't like concerts, you don't like going out. What's how how is that how that come about? Uh, I, me, I I I just like being at home okay. with loved ones, my friends, or maybe travel. But like the wala of having to just party all the time, it's just wala for me. Back to your album because I know that this is one of the reasons why we're here. Who and who were featured in the album? You see when when it comes out. <laughs> how many songs at all? You see when it comes out. Have you ever thought about maybe doing a joint EP or album with your sister? Most deaf. I think it would be amazing. Yes. But I just think it needs to be the right time when both of us have time, come together and make it happen. Okay. So um, I know you said the the COVID period, the lockdown was a very good time for you. So how would you say as an artist and the entertainment industry itself, how would you say the pandemic has affected the industry? Because you can't you can't hold concerts, you can't have your fans around. So how would you say that's affected? Well I think it's been limiting, but we thank God for social media platforms. Um virtual as well. So whatever you need to do, you can still just gather your fans. They might not be physically there with you, but they can link link up with you on on, on social media platforms. Hi guys, my name is Tenny Makanaki and I'm going to be reading my DMs. Hi, so sorry to infringe on your privacy. It said that a picture is worth a thousand words. But when I saw yours, it was more than words could explain. The charming profile is irresistible, though a little personal message, but your look tells a lot about a nice person. Ah. So I had to drop a message to the charming person with this great profile just want to know you better and be a friend or more hope to hear from you sometime Denny, stop hiding show up yourself i want to chat with you okay. hello <laughs> i will chat you back um i don't know i don't even know what to say tiger is eating the head of his life can I come and chop like it? Please answer me now. I don't mind being your dog for a day. What? <laughs> Wait, what? No, please. I don't want you to be my dog for a day. And yes, my dog is actually chopping life. Tiger, can you see that I'm taking care of you? Mm, let me see. <sighs> oh my god. Ridiculous. Angel, hey, God. Okay, this is he has been messaging. Ah, Diva, I really want us to do a collaboration like me and you. Please, I plead you, say something, don't keep silent because I want us to be together. <laughs> so, what will it take? Hey. Goddess, this has become kind of punishment. I only plead to know what it will take to run up. Ah, finish it. I cannot finish. <laughs> ah, no, 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 no. This person is you are crazy. <laughs> Hi, Tanya. I want to. I want you. Eh? I want you to say you are a very good singer. Love from Cameroon. Ah, I love you too. 